It's a similar competition to one that we ran at the University of Queensland. So it's a social Friday night comp. Um, basically, it's, it's getting guys that aren't playing normal club rugby back involved with the sport. Uh, that was the aim here in Toowoomba. We've got a lot of guys that drop out of the sport um, and, and just we lose them. Uh, the good thing about social sports, be that mixed netball or touch rugby league, it brings older players, fathers, sons playing together. Uh, we, we don't have that a great deal in rugby. So that was the, the main driver for, uh, for this competition. Yeah, look, we've had over 100 blokes sign up, which we've been absolutely blown away by. Uh, we've had the Toowoomba Rangers, uh, the University of Southern Queensland Saints, uh, and UQ Gatton uh, all, all play. We've also, we're very, very happy to, to say we've had a great response from the Pacific Islander community. We've got a Pacific Islanders, Kings of the Pacific team. They've come in, they've won our final tonight, bring a lot of physicality to the competition, but um, it's been excellent having that, that community involved uh, with, with, with the competition. After the game, uh, the, the Tongan, Samoan, Fijian, a, a lot of the Pacific Islander communities have, have put on a huge suite of uh, traditional foods. We've got a pig on a spit, we've got traditional curries, just for everyone, all the players, all the fans, and just community members. It's, it's, uh, it brings people together, and that's what rugby's about. It's about families and communities, and we're very proud of, of what we've done tonight. So that was one of the key aims, is to get guys playing the sport that haven't played before. Uh, we've had about 10% of the guys signed up had never played rugby before and 63% of the guys who've signed up weren't playing club rugby in 2018. So that was a key aim and that's what we've delivered and we're, we're really, really proud of that. Mate, I've found it great. Um, it's given me a chance to well, keep fit on the off season but play with some players that I've never even seen before. There's some really handy rugby league players and people that just can't commit to a full season that have been able to come back. It's given me a chance to play with my dad, who hasn't played in 14 years, my little brother. So, to me, nothing better. I hope it unhearths a few more players. We've got some young fellas here, and they don't normally play. Like I said, the league players are here. Um, we're finding some great talent, and these guys have never played rugby before. So this really gives them that gateway to come have a go and not be so competitive. So it gives them a chance to have a bit of fun. It's great. Look, well, obviously, first year, it's very difficult to get something up off the ground, uh, getting the, the word out there. Uh, Next year, we would like to strengthen the competition, build our numbers, uh, perhaps add another team, maybe two. Uh, we have been in discussions with a number of the women's teams about possibility of doing a women's tens tournament um, along similar lines to the men's comp. But uh, yeah, lots, lots of uh, positives to look forward to.